What's good, people? Uncle Hotep back at it again. How y'all doing? Happy Hump Day. Wonky Wednesday. Taylor Swift. <laughs> uh, Taylor Swift has put herself in the political game. She threw herself her hat in the ring. The former darling of 4chan. Yo, I used to go on poll, right? And like, I didn't know. I never got the. Uh, I never got the, the Taylor Swift infatuation, right? Either musically or looks, whatever. I mean, uh, of course, her face is uh, okay. It's pretty, beautiful, but her body's something less to be desired, in my opinion. But to each their own. But you know, four chans ad adoration with. Uh, with Taylor was something to be, it was crazy, man. I guess a lot of people, since her silence, like she would never uh, be political. She never uh, not, uh, got behind a candidate. She never got behind Hillary. She basically kept to herself. She didn't say anything about any political things. And I guess people thought she was a closet Trump supporter and shit like that. You know what I mean? But they were love, love. They used to make memes over memes over memes. They would make Hitler quotes and put it on Taylor Swift like she said it. <laughs> that was the funniest shit ever. But, you know, the, she she broke their hearts. They're into pieces. She uh, uh, She's back in, the, I guess, the Tennessee Canada. That's where she's from, I guess, Tennessee. Um, I don't know. You know what? This shows me the left is, they're pulling out all the stops for this one. They, they're going all out for this, the midterms. Oh shit, I had the fucking radio playing. They were probably gonna bar this music and shit, shit like that. But yeah, they're 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 desperate. They really are. You know, they're putting everything into this midterms. This could be the moment you could own the libs forever. This could be the thousand year Republic. <laughs> but you know, I would hate to be a celebrity when you have to do shit like this, man. Like, cause you, you would have to think that most, most people are, aren't like super into politics like that. You know, most people are like casual, right? You know, there's a lot of people that are semi interested, you know what I mean? But if you were running a multi-million dollar industry, which is yourself, doing tours all over the world, how much interest, how interested are you on the local politics? Like, really? Like, I wouldn't give a damn. I'm like, uh, let me sit behind my gated community, my gated house, and what the peasants do? <laughs> what the broke niggas doing out there? That's what I'd be like. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, this broke me, what? <laughs> That's how I'd be. She writes this long, drawn-ass fucking Instagram post, man. It's, you know, trying to motivate her fans. You know what I mean? You know, I'm sure she's knee-deep in the game in Tennessee. But we'll see what happens. You know, but I think most people thought she was, you know, a closet Republican or something like that. You know, but you're, you're in the... You know, you know, it's Hollywood, but she's in the music industry, but, you know, Hollywood music industry, I mean, they're just, they're two arms on the same body, you know what I'm saying? Anyway, Taylor, good luck to you. <laughs> this is Uncle Hotep, hey, um, uh, Hotep's been told you, uh, episode 16 is up, I mean, it's on tomorrow, and, uh, I'll talk to y'all later, peace.